There are plenty of shapes you can choose from MyDraws library. It's also very easy to create your own custom shapes. You can choose one of the many tools in the tools group. Use the line tool when you want to draw shapes that are made up of straight lines. To draw a single line, click on the line tool button. Place the mouse cursor at the location where you want to start drawing the line. Drag the mouse cursor to the point where you want to end it. To connect different segments, click on the line button. Draw the first line by dragging and releasing the mouse at the location you want. Point the mouse cursor at the end of the first line. You will see tip extend geometry. To close the shape geometry, draw another segment from the end point of the last one to the beginning of the first segment you drew. To select the cubic bezier tool, go to the tools group. When a line is drawn with the cubic bezier tool, it looks like a wavy line. It's very convenient to use when you want to create freeform shapes or as a part of custom geometry. To close the shape geometry, end your drawn geometry at the point where you started. You can use rectangle tool or ellipse tool to draw shapes. To draw a rectangle select the rectangle tool or use the keyboard shortcut. Put the mouse pointer where you want to place the shape. Drag the mouse. Release the mouse when you achieve the desired shape. If you want to make a perfect square, hold the shift key while you drag the mouse cursor. To draw an ellipse select the ellipse tool or use the keyboard shortcut. Put the mouse pointer where you want to place the shape. Drag the mouse. Release the mouse when you achieve the desired shape. If you want to make a perfect circle, hold down the shift key while you drag the mouse cursor. Once you draw the shape with some of these tools you can further modify it. Simply select the pointer and the Edit Geometry tool from the Tools section and the control points of your shape will appear. You can then drag the control points to modify the shape. 